Jam School Remix. Do you want to try a trick that truly feels like actual magic? Get ready for the Di Vernon five card force. I'm gonna lay out five cards here and I'm gonna have you choose one of them. And I've made a prediction about which one you're gonna pick. But I want you to mentally choose one of them. And once you made your choice, I want you to stick with it. Don't tell me which one it is, but let me know. You got one? I got one. All right, now don't change your mind. And all I ask is if I get this right, be honest to tell me. Don't be all like, no, that wasn't it. <laughs> if, it if, if it was, all right? You ready? Okay. Here we go. Is it right? Heavy? Yeah. That was right? That's right. Is that right? Yeah. Was that it? <laughs> was that it? You guys are scary. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that? You got it right. Did I get it right? Uh -huh. It's a pretty good one, huh? Yes. Did I get it right? You saw me looking at it. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't, though. Did, but you picked a different one. Which one? You picked this one right here. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah. <laughs> This relies on a weird psychological defect that causes things to seem a little more random or unpredictable or unusual than they actually are. This one works about 80% of the time and it is brilliant. I don't even know how it works, but for some reason, if you pull out exactly these cards in order, the King of Hearts, the Seven of Clubs, the Ace of Diamonds, the Four of Hearts, and the Nine of Diamonds, that alone will cause most people when they have a free choice to try to pick the Four of Hearts. Don't know why. But you can sweeten the deal by saying something like, you may think that I actually want you to choose one of these cards. By saying that, they'll immediately cancel out the ace is too obvious, the king is too obvious because it's the only face card, the seven is too obvious because it's the only black card, and for some reason, everyone just hates the nine of diamonds. But by process of elimination, 80% of the time, it seems like everybody chooses the four of hearts. Does this work all the time? No, but it works enough of the time that it's very much worth trying. I know this one is risky, but trust me, it feels like nothing less than actual magic. The first time I encountered it was an expert card technique written by Hugard and Brow nearly 80 years ago. Scam School Remix is brought to you by our friends over at Domain.com. If you've been watching Scam School, you know what I'm about to say. You know I'm going to tell you that they're fast, easy, reliable, that they have 99.99% uptime. But most importantly, you know that I'm going to say they're already affordable domains. Get even cheaper when you use promo code SCAMSCHOOL at checkout to get 15% off. Thank you so much, Domain.com, for making Scam School possible. Want more Scam School? Then dive into the complete archive of Scam School Remix episodes. Spanning nine years and 600 episodes, you can do time travel and learn everything all at once. Or follow us on our new adventure, The Modern Rogue. We blow stuff up.